Joe Dementia Biden, I defeated Kamala Hyena Harris. I know that no one can stop me from ending World War III. People in this generation ought to have learned the hard way not to betray themselves or the Americans. Nowadays, people are different. For example, I'm a businessman, and I know how to improve economic marketing every day without letting libtards and demographs affect me. What's the big deal? You're so big that you can't even see your orange peepee when you take off your clothes. I was feeling so under the weather that I could barely, could barely think straight. So you're calling me Joe Dementia Biden, huh? That's a bit of a low blow, don't you think? If I were the leader of America, I can guarantee that Kamala Harris wouldn't have faced defeat like that. Any idea? Any idea? Any idea that, what, uh, Dementia Biden? You finally beat Medicare? Is that what you're trying to say? Do you mean to say that you finally beat Medicare? I'll do that if that's the Don't case. Don't forget that we're old men who can be made fun of. It is too much abuse of power to make me follow what Congress told me to do. I've caused too much damage around, around the world. Yet I had a good personality, so you'll have to clean up my mess until you get Alzheimer's. That's right, that I'm better than you makes you jealous, right? It's not true that I get Alzheimer's because I'm old. I beat Hillary Clinton in 2016. As the saying goes, age is just a number. That's how I normally walk and play golf. To prove to everyone that I'm smarter than you, buddy, I took my test. Some libtards voted for me to replace you on January 20th, 2025, because of this. To fix the problems you caused, Enjoy I'll do anything. Enjoy death threats from people you hate. You didn't understand what it meant for me to become president. This generation has a lot of hidden messages that all Western politicians should pay attention to. If we take a wrong step forward to go with the other options, I think we'll be done with our lives and goodbye. Let's say Hillary won instead of you. She would get butt bombed several times because she's a woman and wouldn't take some strengths. Hey, Joe Dementia Biden, let's talk about your pointless sayings again. You were going to kill me on July 13th, 2024. I was saved, though, thanks to God. There was a plan in your mind to kill me, Dementia Biden. Do you agree? In addition, let's take a closer look at that. To take my life away from this fake world, I think you paid a lot of bitcoins to go to the deep web or dark net, right? Do you remember that you hired a great hitman to put a hole in my right ear? I got up and put up my right hand first as a sign of hope and courage. I stood up without shaking or wobbling, just so you know. Dementia Biden, this would hurt you right away and cause you to die from lack of blood if it happened to you. I'll get back at you big time one day by doing your dirty work. Just watch and learn. Okay, look, um, to begin, I never hired or paid someone to waste your life. Oh, that's the first thing. Remember that in case you forget something important that you might forget by the next day. Another thing is that you seem to have forgotten that there was a Nazi who drove a big truck into a White House barrier. Are you aware of what he planned to do? He meant to kill me and take power. Trump, that shouldn't be a memorial status. No one wants that. I'm not at all like you. Oh, Dementia Biden, I'm so glad you told me about this now. I have been attacked and threatened to be killed more than once, but you only did it once, one time only. Remember that since you're a Democrat, you only had one kill. By killing babies, you worship the devil. Democrats, you also use sorcery, which is another word for black magic. That makes a lot of sense as to why you wanted abortion to be legalized as a main change for this country. Republicans like me are against this decision to kill babies. You want to turn off the shrines? It's a gift from God. Because Donald, you don't uh, let's like not, religion let's not bring enough. more into this, uh, this, 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 this anyway. When it came to abortion, Xavier Becerra and Merrick Garland made the right choice. That's right, Trump. If you only want to blame me, I promise to put them on your list. Furthermore, the idea is that you are a liar and a liar. You didn't care about babies. You wanted babies to be poor. The benefits have already been lost because of the stupid decisions you made by not following COVID-19 rules. Plus, why does religion matter when we have science? Yeah, yeah, keep stripping off your business suit, dementia Joe. Let me speak, Trump. Whatever, who cares? That's exactly what I'm going to give you, Trump. This is a very important message. Rebelling against the orders of very powerful elites will end badly for you. They will go after your family, even relatives who aren't related to you. The whole bloodline will be banished. People were threatening to kill me when I was president. That's because you're not a real man, Dementia Biden. Will you shut up, man? And the way you talk makes me think you drank a gallon of booze to get liver cancer. By the way, you're about to see it coming. You think I'm not taking care of myself? I work in business, Dementia Biden. You are a stupid reptile who only does what it's told like a puppy in school that was only fed when Kamala Harris breastfitted. That's disgusting. You're the sucker. You're the loser. Trump, I'm just giving you advice. And all you was call me stupid names, which I found rude. I only did what I had to do. But you left me with no choice when I became president of this terrible country right away. You already caused me enough trouble. Right now, I'm breaking the whole system because higher-ups told me to. Have fun with that. I'll definitely have fun interacting with pales. I mean, P-word country, Israel, Russia, China, North Korea, and more so-so. Guess what, For Dementia Trump, Biden? Are you going to do this? As president, I know how to do my job well. Do what the hell you want and I'll pick out the plates and put nature on them. 
Have a nice day, Chuck. You know, Trump, just watch out. Things will go as planned. Wait for it.